<laughs> to help us celebrate with a delicious no-fry fish. Taco is chef and wellness expert Charles Chen. Welcome back. Hey. How are you? Good to see you. I'm so excited to be here. Who doesn't love? Yeah. yeah, we've already started. They're already digging in. Oh, Sorry. feel yeah. free to do so. <laughs> this is incredible. Thank you oh so much. Gosh. So this is my favorite time. Taco Tuesdays. I grew up in California, so I love California Fresh. But yeah. I threw an Asian twist to it. So you guys can have fun with your Taco Tuesdays and I give it, it like an Asian flair. Who doesn't love a Taco Tuesday, right? Yes, of course, as, as mm. these ladies over here have already mm. digged in. Yes. Um, so this taco really all starts with the marinade. It starts with the marinade. And I swapped out some ingredients. Yeah you know, which I love to do, yeah. just for that healthier swap, right? So we're starting with that. the gochujang sauce. Mm -hmm. So this is just a fancy word for fermented red chili paste, okay? We could get this at a Korean supermarket. It's not as spicy as you think. It's actually sweet and yeah. tangy. So it's almost like a barbecue sauce. So mm -hmm. don't get intimidated by this color. So we're gonna throw in here some lemon juice. A little bit of avocado oil. Oh, avocado oh, oil. Yes, I'm using avocado oil because it's great for high heat cooking, mm -hmm. but it's also beneficial fats for your brain health. A lot of people stay away from fats, but eat your fats, especially good healthy fats like omegas from the, Absolutely. the avocado. So a little bit of pink salt in here. Okay, I've got to ask too. Pink salt over yes, white salt? What's pink the difference? Salt, I mean, if you're going to be eating salt, why not get some more mineral dense mm -hmm. sea salt? Mm -hmm. So I do pink salt. It comes up from high up in the mountains, and it's a lot more nutritious for us. So the Himalayan pink salt, salt, right? Yes, the Himalayan sea salt. You guys can get that everywhere now. A little bit of cori coriander powder right there just for that smokiness. Mm -hmm. Paprika, a little nice hint of spice, and cumin. Oh, God, both. We were yeah, guessing the so flavors were yeah. like, I taste a little of this. <laughs> yes. Of coriander. Yes, and like garlic game. powder. That's what cooking's all about. And a little bit of SMB chili flakes. This is something oh. you can get from your local Asian supermarket. I love this. Yeah, we this need to guess that one. Mm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so good. So we're just going to stir this up. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. We're going to stir up this paste. OK. What kind of fish are we using today? Oh, so you guys can use any white fish. I'm using mm -hmm. tilapia right now. You guys, all about saving the bank, right? So mm -hmm. use cod, Use buy frozen. This is all about using what you have available. You can buy it when it's on sale. Mm -hmm. and then freeze them and then use them when you need to, right? right. So we're gonna And even in the freezer right section now, they have the really good like wild cod yes, or like wild basically cod. whatever you're looking for. They and it doesn't now. break the bank, which is so amazing. Yeah. So this marinade is almost like, it's nice and it has a nice paste to it. Right. And this is what we're using, tilapia, high in protein. It's a nice white fish, very, very clean, which I love. And we're gonna, yeah. How long would we marinate this for? So I would marinate this for about 15 minutes if you can, but if you're in a hurry, which a lot of people are, <laughs> five minutes is fine, all right? All right. All right, so we're gonna put this marinade into the fridge and then we'll take it out later, then start your ovens at 425. Okay. And we're gonna pop this in to the oven when it's ready. All right, well, it's preheated. About nine to 10 minutes, okay? Oh wow, that's fast. Yeah, it depends on your oven. And we're gonna take this one out because we have some already prepared right here. And I love that you're baking it. Again, yes. you don't have to fry it. No, you don't have to fry it. Here's my little trick for not frying it because I'm not about a mushy taco. I like some textures, yeah. but I'm gonna teach you how to add some texture without adding all that extra high fat that's been right. fried, right? All so right. the tortilla that we're using mm -hmm. today, this is a special tortilla. This looks like a regular tortilla. Yeah, it tastes like a regular tortilla. Yeah. yeah, it's made out of almond flour and cassava flour. So it's gluten free. No way. Free. Yes, you would even be able to tell. Your kids will love it. Don't tell them. And you're getting extra protein in here. So you would never ever know. No. Yes. And our slaw right here is made out of purple cabbage, mm -hmm. some pickled ginger. We have some garlic and cilantro. You yeah. can make this ahead of time. So good. I love all the colors it's yeah. going to add, right? And I mean, we you do a crema. Serve that next yes. to the fish and be done with it. Oh my gosh. And then I the next know. day do tacos. I know, but you know, we like to keep it fancy, right? <laughs> yeah. was it. All right, so the crema we're going to yeah. add right here. This has, we have some avocado mayo, which is dairy free. I didn't even know avocado mayo existed. Yes, it's dairy either. free, so yeah. There's so many things that you can get nowadays. It's so awesome. Some lemon juice. And then I have some miso paste right here, which I love. I'm gonna use I love all of the swaps you mm -hmm. use yes. to Thank make things you. healthier. And I mean, you know, you know this firsthand from your own health journey. Yeah. I'm losing so much weight. I mean, it's, it's still, every single time I say this, it's hard for me to believe yeah. that as a teenager, you were heavier and you had to go on yes. this journey. It's unbelievable. Yeah. You know, you're so fit and you're so healthy Thank now. you, thank you. So yes, I lost over a hundred pounds and I just want to show all the kids and all the families out there that you can eat healthy and you can feel good about it and you don't have to gain weight. You know, 
know, well, obesity is, yeah, one of the rising things. You would never know. Like, I just would no, think would like, never that know. would totally be worth it no. if I was counting calories. Yeah. I'd be like, oh, yeah, that's a yeah. lot. I don't care. It tasted <laughs> that yeah. day. Yeah. Yeah. I'm the worst at diets. I'm yeah. like, just, I just want the ice cream. But just flavor. give me a healthier swap, right? Yeah. yeah. So you're so, not sacrificing any of the flavor. No, flavor. not at all. So let's build this taco. I am going to put this fish in. The fish looks beautiful. Oh, my gosh. This looks so great. It just literally breaks on the bone. You don't even need the whole thing. Oh, my gosh. Flakes right and off. Put it right and a here nice, in the healthy center. piece. Right. Yes. And then we'll put some of this on here. Okay. Well, the fish is so light, and all we're tasting is that wonderful concoction that you made. The spices. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Beautiful. And look, you're sneaking in some veggies with mm -hmm. the color on there. And, and this the gives crunch. some good yep. texture. And this is the, the cabbage. fun part. Yes, the, the cabbage. And then let's build this up. So we have some avocados Alrighty. right here. We got yeah. cilantro. Again, nice healthy And I use pickled fat. ginger. So if you guys never That's played with pickled ginger, delicious. Oh, it has a nice sweet and sour Ooh. sauce on there and a, a little nice texture as well. So Is I'm that garlic there that you have? What? Garlic chips? No, these are these are toasted coconut flakes. Oh, so the crunch for the, yes. was so yes. perfect. Yes. And there's different flavors now, which you can really have fun with. Some fresh lime oh juice. God. I thought it was like almonds or I like shaved garlic. almonds or something. Mm. This is like a gourmet taco, mm. guys. And they're I'm delicious. Yeah. Yeah. No, you can't get this at a taco truck, but you can make it at home. It's so easy. Well, we should make a taco truck and like, start serving yes. this. And then last so but not least, some sriracha mayo, mm -hmm. just for that Yum. extra nice tang. And I love a little nice paprika. Oh my gosh. Charles, <laughs> who doesn't want this taco? It's a work I think of art. You might need a, we might need a knife and a fork. Oh, I know. I don't know how I'm going to eat this. I've got one over here, too. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you Thank so much. You for so being much. Here, Charles. We Thank love it when you. You're here. That is really fantastic. And as always, the full recipe is available on mm. hallmarkchannel.com. And for more from Charles, you can visit his website.